finally, let's see how late you are this time, David. Fashionably. Yeah, because Levi jeans and a t-shirt is definitely a new trend. What's the game tonight? Five card draw. Are you sure you want to play that? As I recall, the last time we played, you spent most of your time whining. Hey, if you were getting the cards that I was getting, you'd be agitated too. Listen to him, he's already complaining. Maybe we should play Go Fish? That might be closer to your speed. All right, five card draw it is. <laughs> so, what's the next topic? Rose McGowan's plastic surgery blunder? <laughs> Seriously, her face always seems to smile with or without her consent. The perfect murder. Ooh, I like this one. What to start with, I'd use acid to get rid of the body. <laughs> yeah, now I've seen Breaking Bad too, man. Yeah, but if you do that, then someone will come looking for whoever is killed. The first rule to a perfect murder is that you have to make it look like an accident. True. Hey Gabe, you have any more of that whiskey? Yeah, I do actually. Seems like the best way to make something look like an accident would be with drugs. Like an overdose or something. Damn. I think I have your luck this time, Zach. Oh, God, this whiskey is so good. So, drug overdose then? I don't know. I guess it would depend on the reason for the murder. I'm just saying if it was personal, I would like them to know that I killed them. Them? I thought this was a murder. I suppose you would need a good motive to plan something so intricate. So what kind of motive? What if the group of individuals had a dark secret? Something they believed they got away with? What if... They were responsible for the death of another human being. A young woman, perhaps. You doing okay, David? Don't look too well. You see, what I would do is I'd find the group responsible so I could work my way in. I'd spend about two to three years getting to know them so that they can trust me. Maybe even play poker a couple times a week. I would then slip Vecuronium into something they might consume. Perhaps a bottle of whiskey. Ah, Vecuronium. This wonderful little drug's a powerful paralytic that's usually administered along with an anesthetic before surgery. But of course... I want you all awake for this moment. Her name was Valerie. She was my sister. Well, that's my cue. You know, these will kill you.
you know, in this moment. I like to think that my sister got the last laugh.